Hello everyone and welcome back to Decoders. I am Tai Prishi and in this video I will show you how to use a slider in Corilla. So let's open up created.corilla.io in your browser and you will see a screen like this. So if you don't know the basics of Corilla then make sure to check my video of the introduction using the i button or the link given in the description below. Now create a project I will name it as slider underscore tutorial. Okay. Let me keep it dark theme and finish. Let it load. Now, in this basic tutorial, we will just learn how to take the input of the slider and print it on a label. You can use this simple code in every application you are using a slider. Just uh, we have to change the inner code of the slider component and the rest of it will be same. So now let's take out a label and a slider. Okay. Let me take out a label first and then a slider. Now let's set up the label. I'll keep it font bold, font size 20, typeface I will keep it over to regular, height automatic, vertical parent and keep the text empty, keep it central. Now let us set up the display properties of the slider. Go to slider. Uh, the color left is the color which on, is on the left and the color right on the right. You can customize it but I recommend to keep it as one looks awesome. So now let me keep the width of fill parent. Max value I will keep it 100. You can keep it 50, 100, 100 150, 200, 1000, 2000 any of it. Now I will keep the minimum value as 0. Now the thumb color means the button type color which you see on the slider is called as a thumb and its color is the default one here which is the color of the left area uh, I will keep it default and keep the thumb position which is the default position when you open up an app so I will keep it 50. Okay now the design properties are done let's go to the block section and code our app. Now we are, what we have to do is when the slider will be moved the text of the label will be kept as the value of the slider. So as we have kept the value of the slider of 0 to 100 the numbers will be shown from 0 to 100. And when we have to trigger it when the slider is moved. So go to slider and drag this here. When slider 1 position changed and do we, have, we will set up this now. So if you saw in my previous videos we did a uh, set label one text and then the text we want to set it to so let's uh, we have to go to label then scroll down and uh, just get any of it and we have to click set it and we have to set it text now we have to change the text to the thumb position so let's take the thumb position get thumb position and set it here now we have to add a round of option too because if we do not add a round of option then it will show the number in decimal points so if you want it in decimal points you can keep it as it is but as we are making a basic app and just a clear app for the one to uh, for the zero to hundred numbers then i will keep it the round of options so go to math and uh, here you will find a option named as round so let's take it here okay the code is now done let's test our app using the code companion I will start recording the screen. Okay, now we are in the Corolla Companion app. Let's scan the QR code. Uh, we, have to click, we have to click on scan QR code. And on the PC, you have to click on test and connect to our companion. And scan the QR code. Okay, the app is now loaded. Let's test it. You can see that the number is clearly printed on the slider when I move it from the beginning to the end, from 1 to 100. Now uh, I will just change the value to 1000 to show you that uh, it can be taken to upper limits as well. So now I have changed it to 1000 and the app has reloaded. So you can see that we can change it to 1000. So that's it for this video. So that's it for this video and so that's it for this video guys make sure to subscribe our channel by clicking on the subscribe button and clicking on the notification bell also don't forget to like this video and comment down your thoughts goodbye
जय हिंद जय भारत नहीं तो ठीक जय हिंद जय भारत गुड बाय चुकल एडिट करता चल So that's it for this video guys make sure to subscribe our channel by clicking on the subscribe button and clicking on the notification bell also don't forget to like this video and comment down your thoughts jai hind jai bharat goodbye